see, it's my real kitchen. My dishwasher's done. Hey everybody, this is Nook, and welcome back to my kitchen. Today, I have a really, really cool box I'm excited to share with you. It is called Awakening in a Box. It has to do with tarot cards, oracle cards, and crystals. In one box, you can get, it's called Awakening Box, and it's $13.33. Next, cheapest one is the Crystal Pouch, and that is $14.08. The Oracle Box, and that comes $32.08. Then there's the Mystic Tarot Box, which is also $32.08. There is one other choice, the Tarot and Oracle Box, and it's $54.08. You get the Tarot Deck and the Oracle Box, so you don't have to make a choice. I just opted for the Tarot Deck. The lady that owns the company was nice enough when I saw what was coming next month I wrote her a message and told her that I really didn't want that tarot deck and for the next month could I have it switched over so that I could get the oracle deck and she said no problem and she switched me it's a way to grow your tarot card collection and or your oracle card collection or if you're just starting out like I am and you don't have anything and you really don't know what's out there, this was really kind of a neat box to see and get monthly. It's just her and her husband that have been packaging the boxes. She has fibromyalgia, so her immune system is compromised. Just the two of them in her house that they could get them out and ship. It might take a little longer. It comes in this brown box and let's jump into it and see what's all in here. I need some fun. But I think we all do. <laughs> I don't think I'm the only one. Okay. Let's see. There comes, it's a really neat dream catcher card. Card gives us what's in the box and the prices. I don't really want to ruin all the surprises. I'm going to just set this aside. There's this really cool kitchen refrigerator magnet. It is like a picture of a galaxy with like the chakra colors in that. I think that's really cool. Instead of a sticker, we have a, a magnet. I like that. Ooh, we have a necklace. It just, it's one of those that just goes on. It's a stretchy one, so you don't have to worry about it. This is a bracelet, by the way. <laughs> it's not a necklace. You get this bracelet, which I think is beautiful. It's like a gray stone. It actually matches the Queen's Bee bracelet that I got a couple weeks ago, which I think is really cool. How's that for fate? It tells you what the stone is. Larvacite, eight millimeter round. What is a larvacite? Larvacite can be used to treat skin disorders and enhances vitality and youthfulness. I could use that, youthfulness. Larvacite aids the recovery of strokes and helps brain function. It cleans and purifies body tissue, harmonizes the metabolism, and helps with muscular detoxification. Larvacite calms the nerves and will cool and reduce blood pressure. Well, that's really cool. And then next, I got a card and I have a black pyramid. Black tourmaline pyramid. Affirmation, I give myself permission to heal. Black tourmaline is a protective stone which repels and blocks negative energy within a person or space. It will cleanse, purify, and transform dense energy into a lighter vibration. Black tourmaline has calming effect when needed, grounding chaotic energies into the earth. Those who deal with anxiety, depression, etc. can work with black tourmaline to help heal these issues. Aligns with the root chakra and zodiac sign Capricorn. And it's really a a neat pyramid. So there it is. It's really black. There's a lot more in here than I thought. And then we have, oh, we got a little keychain with a crystal on it. And on the one side, it's like the rough crystal. And then you turn it around, it's all polished and smooth. This is a nice ring too for the a key ring. It's one of those nice sturdy ones. I wonder, not that I would do it exactly like this, but 
That would actually make a cool a cool necklace. I like that. It looks a little silly on with the ring, but I really like that. Oka or it can be spelled O C H O geodes are small agate geodes with a druzy crystal lining that are found in the Tres Pine Heroes region of Brazil. They are very grounding and balancing stones. It's real spark sparkly. This little part here. This is really pretty. For the big item, we have the Crystal Power Tarot deck. These were made by Jane Wallace. The book includes interpretations for all the cards plus the properties of their crystals and shows how to lay out the cards for reading. From relationship to advice to career guidance, this unique crystal tarot illuminates what's important to you now and gives you the means to make your wishes come true. I'm, I'm excited. I'm very excited. The back of the cards look like this they have a like a crystal pattern on them which is really pretty with all the colors of the rainbow then there's a tarot book and it goes through each card and explains what each card is about it's got the pictures by them and it's got this is where the stones are yeah, it gives you how to choose your cards. It does give you contents, introduction, crystal power spreads, it, and then it tells you about each card. You can do a one card reading. It does give you information how to use the deck of cards, which I think is pretty cool. One card readings. These are really pretty. Just the, the colors. I really like that. This is a pretty deck. There we go. So there it is. The Hanged Man. I can see this situation another way. A young man is suspended upside down from a tree. The tree is a representation of the tree of life, sacred symbol of the enduring connectedness of all things. He is tethered to a branch by one foot, yet he appears unharmed and peaceful, awaiting whatever the future brings. The luminous selenite rocks below him symbolize his connection to the spiritual world, meaning you may feel in limbo as you wait for events to speed up or for others to make a move. The card, however, asks you to make the most of this impasse and to see your situation from another angle. An additional meaning is considering a compromise as a way forward. The hangman can show meditation, spiritual awareness, and spiritual initiation. These are all very watercolor pastel. But they're nice, thick cards. Really nice. And very big. Really well made. And it gives you a nice box to hold them in. Oh, I'm really excited about that. This is a really neat box. So let's kind of recap what we got. We got our instructions and a really nice tarot deck. We got a card that tells about the Black Tourmaline Pyramid crystal that we received. I could use that in my life. We got a refrigerator magnet, which I'm sure you'll be seeing on my refrigerator. There is a card that comes and there's a lot of explanation of what you're getting. It is a really pretty picture. And then we got our geo. I really like that the back of it is left natural and the front shows what's on the inside. That I, I really want to see if I can somehow attach it to my necklace and then we got our Larvakite eight millimeter stretch bracelet it's prettier in person than what it's looking like on on the video and that's it but that's a lot i really am impressed with this box and everything that came in it i'm looking forward to playing and learning more about the cards i can't wait to see what next month is going to be because I don't I don't have an oracle deck and I don't really know anything about oracle decks so I'm going to be really excited to see what comes in that box. Thank you so much for stopping and spending some time with me and I hope you have a really great day. 
night, evening, wherever you are. Thanks. Bye.